just in time. Thank you. Great. Look at that. Thank you. I think I know my answer already. <laughs> <laughs> it looks good. Hi. I'm Emma Chancredo. I'm Sophia Periani. I'm Reese Harvey. And we have created a vegan cupcake brand named Regan Vegans. So practically what we did is we took uh, one of her gra her grandparents' work in a bakery. They own their own bakery. And so we substituted one of their recipes for cupcakes with different vegan alternatives because every day her grandpa gets questions about what they put in their products and if any of them are vegan because there's been a recent in mm -hmm. past decades of the trend of veganism. So we decided to create our vegan cupcake for that. Yeah, so we have a chocolate <laughs> vegan cupcake with vanilla frosting that we substituted ingredients into to make vegan cupcakes. We're them for $200 and 20% equity. Mm -hmm. And with that investment, we can extend our brand and make vegan cookies, cakes, and ice creams. Any questions? First of all, is this, uh, we can eat this? Or we yes, can yes, go it? for it. Okay. Go for it. Have you started to sell these at all? We have. My aunt, she is a vegan, so she's bought a lot of them and like gave them to her vegan friends as well. Can you give us an idea of how much you sell one for and how much it costs you to make? It costs about five fifty to make a batch of twelve. Okay. And we sell them for about two fifty each. That's a great markup. <laughs> and that's the delicious dollars. cupcake. That's a really good cupcake. We'll, we'll take your word. Yes, it is. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thanks. So that's, this is 100% um, vegan? Yes, 100%. Okay. There's no animal products in them. The frosting, everything. Even the flour in the top. <laughs> Where do you make these currently? Well, we uh, are making them in our kitchens right now. Okay. And you're selling them how? Through we're the bakery? No, uh, we're just selling them to uh, people that we know that are vegan. Like, we have one of our really good friends. She buys them from us sometimes whenever she wants a good treat. Uh, and her aunt. What's the inspiration for the name? <laughs> we kind of named it after Reese. Yeah. But uh, we don't really know why. Oh, Reese Vegan. On vegan with Reese's name. Oh, okay. All right. Nice. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> You say you want to use the money to expand into other products. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, I would imagine ice cream is one of them. Or yes. you're already doing ice cream. Mm -hmm. No, not we yet. have not started any other products yet, but okay. we plan on doing that. Do you have the recipe for the ice cream? No, we would have to look into that more. Okay. And do you have the equipment to make ice cream? Yes. Yeah, I do. Yes. Okay. So when you say you're going to use the money to expand, Share a little more specifics around that. Okay. Okay. Well, expanding more as in we want Regan's to be more of a brand than just like the cupcake itself. And so we want to be more than just a cupcake. We want to make cookies and ice cream and just other treats that other vegans can enjoy that they usually wouldn't be able to. So you want to use this $200 for marketing purposes? Uh, well, that would be a part of it, but we'd also have to pay for all the ingredients that go into it. Okay. Have you approached any bakeries? You, I think you said some relatives have bakeries to see if they would carry your product. Yes, we've talked to my grandpa about it, and he okay. would have carried our product. Yes. Has he, he given you an idea of how much he would sell per day or per week, how much he would buy? Um, we yeah. don't have an idea of that. Uh, we're not sure exactly. He doesn't sell vegan cupcakes yet, so he doesn't know how well they sell. Okay. But he gets a lot of questions as to if he has vegan cupcakes. I feel like okay. a lot of his customers would buy them. Have you looked at commercial kitchens and uh, the possibility of renting commercial kitchens for time? Uh, we have not, just because of how small our brand is right now. Mm -hmm. But once we expand, we're going to look more into that. Once since we will start making more different treats. More so if I give you this two hundred dollars, what's your first next step? Our next step would probably be uh, making more of them. So ingredients. Yes, and then also trying to get a bakery to take us in so that we can sell through a store. Okay. So do all three of you, you know, what skills do you have? I mean, you did a nice job of all presenting different aspects of, of your company, but um, do you have any particular skills, like who came up with the recipe, who would be making it? And me um, and Sophia kind of came up with the recipe together. We just like took different, um, we substituted different vegan, the animal products with vegan alternatives, 
-hmm. and just like figured out or tasted it until it like tasted good. But we did take um, the actual cupcake recipe itself from her grandparents, the bakery itself. Great. And we just substituted stuff into it and tweaked it around until it tasted right. As you guys said, it tastes pretty good. (laughs) No, it tastes great. Yeah. (laughs) Reese, what is your role in the company? I've been just helping Megan. Okay. It's his name. Yeah. Yeah. He's the yeah. name. Yeah. He's, he's, he's the namesake. He's the name. He's the van boy. Kind of boss him around. Uh-huh. I, really, I mean, I, I really like what you're doing and what you've done so far and really admire you for bringing something in for us to see because that, that makes such a huge difference mm-hmm. to an investor that they could actually see what you're talking about. Mm-hmm. Um, so I, I would be very happy to make the investment for 20%, $200, but the stipulation would be I want it in your grandparents' bakery. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, so contingent on we could totally, there. Yeah. I feel like if we got an investor behind us and some more firepower that like we would be able to get into different bakeries mm-hmm. just being ourselves alone is right. not going to help got it. so much so yeah when you expand or, you know project into the future what you think the revenue could be for your company what figure comes to mind in the first year the first six months how much money are you going to gross um, I, I'm not sure okay. exactly. No <laughs> okay. Um, I would also be willing to look at this um, with more points of distribution. Because um, when I run this out in my mind, I'm thinking if, if you're looking at $30 for 12 cupcakes, I think you're underpriced based on what I'm paying for cupcakes that have the animal products and the sugar and all the other bad stuff. Mm -hmm. I think you're underpriced. And if you were willing to secure four points of distribution, I would be willing to give you $400 for 20%. Mm -hmm. So it is a good deal. But it would yeah. be contingent on you having four locations. So, so four places would, that would sell your product. That would give you a piece of paper that says, yes, I will sell your cupcakes. Mm-hmm. And yes. they place orders with you. I would be willing to give you $400. For 20%. For 20%. For 20%. So double, Great. basically double value. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Ben? Thank you. With that big chunk of that cupcake that you ate there, what do you think? <laughs> Yeah, and I haven't eaten mine yet. Yeah. Me neither. So. We, the two of us have made deals. <laughs> my money might, might, might go up. Yeah. <laughs> what do they say about eating your profits? <laughs> yeah. um, I don't know enough about this particular business to, to involve myself in it, but so far I like what I see. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so yeah. much. Um, and I'll say I loved it. It's, I've had a lot of cupcakes. And this is, you know, by far probably one of the better ones I've had. <laughs> if you didn't tell me it was vegan, or I wouldn't know the difference. I would just say that's a delicious cupcake. Thank, Thank but, you um, so much. But that's not my area of expertise. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. I mean, I'll be a, a customer, a loyal customer, wherever <laughs> you have it. I'll b- be buying them and eating them Are by the good? dozens. <laughs> but um, that's not, you know, the value. I think part of it, too, is uh, having the value of being able to help you folks grow. And I don't Thank see you. myself doing that for the cupcakes, but um, I love the product. Thank, Thank you. Thank you so much. So then I, to recap, so we have... Well, I'd like to change my offer because I think you guys have a lot of a potential. I think you're probably a little bit light on the financials, so I'd want to work with you on that and looking a little bit forward to getting into a commercial kitchen and being prepared for success. So I'd be willing to match Matt's offer for $400 at 20%, but again, only stipulating that you go into your grandparents' bakery because so that will be a great okay. test market. Yeah. Yes. So let me bring this out there. So Matt's offer was $400, basically doubling it. Twice a month, four hundred dollars for the same twenty percent, mm-hmm. but it's contingent on you being in four different places. So not just your grandparents, but three others. Okay. Okay. okay? And then Darlene's would do a match. And here's what I would say: is there's an opportunity here where there's a, a foundation that would match that two hundred dollars. So if you put in two hundred, this foundation would also put in two hundred dollars. So the same four hundred dollars mm-hmm. for twenty percent. But was it contingent upon? Just being in the first bakery. I want to see you in the first in your bakery, pa- in your, your grandparents. grandparents' bakery. So you only have yeah. to be in one. Yeah. Okay. So. So you have two different offers. Which one do you think? Or would you take any? Um, so Matt or Darlene? <laughs> Darlene, it would be great to work with you. Great. I'd awesome. love to work nice. with you guys. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Good job. Very great job. Great job. Great job. Great job. I love it all. This is a yeah. great presentation. Very nice job, yeah. That was delicious.
If you're not gonna use maybe can I keep your eyes for? Her? Yeah. Yeah, it's really good. It's really good. <laughs> we'll see if there's a deal I like. I might have to use that as yeah, part. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> I'm gonna change my offer now. Yeah. You don't like it's it? Six hundred delicious. Oh, okay. You like it more? Yeah. <laughs>